Hello and welcome to Indus News live from Islamabad. I am Muneeb Hamid with the headlines of this hour. Indian troops have martyred three more civilians in occupied Kashmir, raising the toll to over a dozen this month. The occupation forces targeted the youths during a cordon and search operation in the Amshipura area of Shopinya district. The occupied valley has been under New Delhi's crushing curfew and communications blackout for the past 348 days. In the U.S., civil rights leader from the 1960s movement, John Lewis has died at the age of 80 after a battle with pancreatic cancer. A protege of Martin Luther King Jr., Lewis was elected in 1986 as a Democrat to the U.S. House of Representatives from Georgia. Lewis was a victim of police brutality and suffered a skull fracture in March 1965's infamous Bloody Sunday. The European Union has offered a revised plan for the bloc's proposed economic recovery fund from 750 billion euro to 450 billion euros. Council President Charles Michael said the plan on the second day of the summit in Brussels. Diplomats say the proposal will also increase rebates on the core EU budget for Austria, Denmark and Sweden. The global number of COVID-19 cases has exceeded 14 million, while the death toll has crossed 600,000. This comes as the US posted another record cases with over 77,000 people testing positive in the past day. The total number of infections in the country has dropped 3.6 million with over 139,000 deaths. In Brazil, 1,163 people have died overnight, increasing the toll to nearly 77,000. Meanwhile, in Pakistan, 47 people have lost their lives in the past 24 hours, raising the total to 5,522 with nearly 262,000 cases. Well, that's all for now. For the latest updates, you can follow us on social media at Indus.news. Take care.